Welcome to today's lecture on the intricate world of biochemistry, where we will delve into the fascinating realm of DNA, RNA, and nucleotide metabolism. DNA and RNA are essential molecules that play vital roles in the intricate machinery of life. They carry the genetic information necessary for the functioning, development, and regulation of all living organisms. Let us start our journey by exploring the basic structure and properties of our genetic blueprints, DNA and RNA. DNA, deoxyribonucleic acid, is a double-stranded helical molecule containing a sugar phosphate backbone and four nitrogenous bases, adenine, A, thymine, D, cytosine, C, and guanine, G. RNA, ribonucleic acid, on the other hand, is usually single-stranded and contains the bases A, uracil, U, C, and G, with a ribose sugar phosphate backbone. Moving forward, we uncover the intricate process of DNA replication, where an exact copy of DNA is synthesized. This process involves the unwinding of the double helix, template strand recognition, and the sequential addition of complementary nucleotides by DNA polymerase enzymes. It is a highly regulated and precise process vital for cell division and genetic stability. Next, we explore transcription, the process by which genetic information encoded in DNA is transferred to RNA. Transcription requires the recognition of specific DNA sequences by RNA polymerase enzymes, resulting in the synthesis of a complementary RNA molecule. This newly synthesized RNA molecule can serve various functions, including coding for proteins or regulating gene expression. Once transcribed, RNA molecules undergo processing events that modify and refine their structure, ensuring their functional competence. These processing steps include capping, splicing, and polydentylation, which collectively contribute to regulating RNA stability, transport, and translation efficiency. Now, let's venture into the intricate world of translation, the process through which RNA molecules direct the synthesis of proteins. Translation involves the decoding of the RNA sequence by ribosomes, the trinomediated delivery of amino acids, and the assembly of a polypeptide chain. This highly orchestrated process governs the creation of functional proteins with diverse roles in cellular processes. Transitioning to nucleotide metabolism, we explore the importance of nucleotide salvage pathways. These pathways allow cells to recycle nucleotides by salvaging and reusing free nucleobases and nucleosides. This process is vital for maintaining an adequate supply of nucleotides necessary for DNA and RNA synthesis while minimizing energetic requirements. In contrast to salvage pathways, the de novo biosynthesis of nucleotides involves the synthesis of nucleotides from simpler precursors. This complex process requires the coordinated efforts of multiple enzymatic reactions to produce purine and pyrimidine nucleotides, ensuring the cell's constant supply of these crucial building blocks. To maintain nucleotide homeostasis, cells tightly regulate the rate of nucleotide biosynthesis. Various feedback mechanisms, elasteric regulation, and the coordination of multiple enzymes are involved in maintaining appropriate nucleotide levels, ensuring optimal cellular function. Thymidine, a key component of DNA, is synthesized through a specific pathway that ensures its availability for DNA replication and repair. We will explore the intricacies of thymidine synthesis, including the involvement of folate as a cofactor and the regulation of key enzymes. As DNA is constantly subjected to damage from various sources, efficient DNA repair mechanisms are necessary to maintain genome integrity. We will unravel the diverse DNA repair mechanisms, including base excision repair, nucleotide excision repair, mismatch repair, and double-strand break repair, highlighting their significance in preventing mutations and diseases. Delving into the application of biochemistry in medicine, we examine the use of nucleotide analogs as therapeutic agents. These synthetic compounds mimic natural nucleotides and can disrupt DNA or RNA synthesis in cancer cells or viruses, showcasing their potential as targeted therapeutics. Our journey through the world of nucleotide biochemistry concludes with a discussion on microRNAs, miRNAs, small non-coding RNAs that play a critical role in post-transcriptional gene regulation. We explore how miRNAs interact with mRNA molecules, leading to their degradation or translational repression, providing a nuanced layer of regulation and gene expression. In conclusion, our exploration of DNA, RNA, and nucleotide biochemistry has revealed the intricate processes and pathways that underpin life itself. From the fundamental structure and replication of DNA to the regulation of gene expression through miRNAs, these molecular mechanisms govern the complex machinery of living organisms. Understanding these processes and their regulation not only deepens our knowledge but also unveils potential therapeutic strategies for combating diseases and improving human health. As we continue on our journey through the vast world of biochemistry, 
we are constantly reminded of the remarkable elegance and complexity of life at the molecular level.